I may have overslept and have a call in 10 minutes. So I have a little break in between my calls and I have, uh, for those of you that don't know, I have polycystic ovarian syndrome. So I get like a lot of dark hair right down here. So roughly every two weeks or so, I kind of come in with some wax and I just tear it all off. So yeah, I had some time in between my calls and a shower is necessary because I need to wake up and do my skincare routine. And this also sucks out blackheads. I do that too, it's like a little vacuum. And he goes, me. <laughs> so now that I'm all done with my five back-to-back -back calls, and I'm showered. We are going to be working on Olivia's third video. We are making hot cocoa pops. Hi. Hi. Are you eating the chocolate? <laughs> so that's kind of how you do it. You melt it. I cut mine and put them into cupcake tins because they hold better in the freezer when I need them to dry. All right, we are moving on to step two because we're just about frozen here. We're almost there, we're waiting for the milk to steam. Look at the milk. Is it boiling? No, look. The milk. It's See it melting? Uh oh, I see marshmallows. Well, that is magical, alright. Now give it a stir. Say, so make sure you stir it up. Make sure you stir it up. Ooh, it's turning chocolate. Chocolate, it really is. So we dropped Olivia off, which means we get to go drinking. So I never really liked beer prior. And then I came to this bar and I had their Hawaiian punch. It's, I thought it was a sour, but it's like, what up? Fur liner, vice something. You guys, it was a slippery slope from there. I have become a sour beer girl. It's so good. We also bought three, four packs to take home. So from the menu before, I did eight through 12, right? Or no, eight through 11. And because, you know, you have to have food when you order at a bar, we got chips. All right, so we already know that number eight's my jam. What is number nine, Jeffrey? Number nine is peanut butter strawberry sour. Peanut butter strawberry sour. Which is one of the ones I was debating getting. You get the peanut butter right at the end. Like, I almost feel like I have peanut butter in my mouth. It's really good. Fun. All right, number 10. Sour IPA. Thanks, Jeff. I think that's the cherry pomegranate. Cherry pomegranate. Mm. I like that. They have this on four pack too. That's really good. Not Hawaiian punch good, but really good. I had to say what I like. The last stuff is a double cherry sour IPA. I don't really, I don't I like IPAs sour. typically. No. But it's a sour. It says sour, sour IPA though. Here we go. Ooh, guys! I swear, whenever I come here, there's not something that I don't like. We're gonna have to get more four back out. Never is. 
All their stuff is so good. And then of course, the PA de Resistance. It's just so good. It's like childhood happiness on adult steroids. What one was that? Off the books, doing what I did. Mine are better because you get to hear the flavors. <laughs> What do you have there? Nothing. Something up here. <laughs> now we are getting a little classier with a smoky mezcal grapefruit cocktail. And Jeff's got a Coke. I gotta drive. There's just something about a charcuterie board that brings me happiness. Why are you slightly disappointed in this cheese board? Have you seen yours? <laughs> what do you mean? Well, Ten times bigger. And filled in. Mm -hmm. <laughs> the pickled veggies are really good though. Mm -hmm. I low key can't wait to eat this cold later. Or in the middle of the night. Or for breakfast. Mm. I didn't start the fire. I've been having issues finding this straw. It's a very good cocktail, it's gin and hibiscus. We just made it home. It's after 10. That's when COVID comes out. <laughs> just kidding. Um, but yes, yeah, so we're gonna snug with the puppies and I do have some work to do tomorrow, so maybe we'll bring you along for that. Or maybe we'll do something fun. I haven't decided. Bye guys.